and then click this one. Let's create new well. Okay, in create new well, we have ID and the type of the well, constraints, multipliers, well bore, and injected fluid. Okay, the starting point, I want to change the name to CO2 underscore injector. Okay, because it's CO2 injection well. The type, open the drop down menu, and of course, it's injector. Okay, group, no need to define the group for the time being. And it, in order to keep the new type, the constraint has to be set to. Of course, later we will go to the constraints. And simulation start date, yes, the year 2000. So then we go to constraints. Here we will set the constraints or the control points. Let's add. Let's tick this one constraint, constraint definition. And the first constraint, open the drop down menu, operate. And I will change, you open the drop down menu, the parameter. Let's change the surface gas rate, STG surface gas rate, maximum to be 10,000 meter cube per day. And the action, let's expand this column. It's continue repeat, okay? And then the second constraint is operate and I will set the bottom hole pressure, bottom hole pressure maximum to be 44,500 kPa, and again, it's continuous. Okay, so I have two control points, the surface gas rate, and then the bottom hole pressure, or bottom hole injection pressure. Okay, so far so good. And then we can skip the multipliers. Currently, we apply one, okay? And no need also to define a more detail for the wellbore model for the time being, but we need to set the injected fluid, okay? By default, it is water injection, but if you open the drop-down menu, we change it to solvent, okay? It is considered solvent, but we want to inject pure CO2, so the mole fraction will be one, and the total will be unity, or one. Okay, you can also click normalize, but in this case, we only have two components and we want to inject pure CO2 for CO2 storage. So small fraction of one. Click OK. All right, so far, so good. And if you open the, the wells, okay, open again, you see still, there is still a red ball. We have not completed yet we need to define the perforation or the completion. Let's click this one, double click. I will expand the window. 